even a balloon can be used for a fun time. Whoops! Who said that you can only use Elmer's glue for boring homework? Draw a unicorn silhouette on a piece of paper. Apply Elmer's glue inside the outline. Sprinkle it with glitter. Blow off the excess glitter through a straw. Done! You have probably never met such a shiny unicorn before. Isn't it cute? For the next idea, you are going to need a piece of black paper and white paint. Apply contrasting strokes with a wide brush. Let the paint dry and get a thin brush. The warm shades look great on the white paint. Mix the colors into soft transitions. Add a yellow strip to the orange section. Color the space above it with blue paint. Make the border strip green. Paint the top black. Create a dark blue transition. Paint the lower part of the smear. Place a beam of light in the center. Draw the sun. Draw a sailboat with black paint. Highlight the side of the boat with white. Color the water with sunset colored paints. See? You can easily paint a beautiful evening landscape. The black background makes the picture look even brighter. And now take a sheet of paper and a ruler. Draw a line in the center with a black marker. Draw a curved line from one part of the sheet to another. And now, follow your imagination. First, draw a bird, a head, eyes, and a beak. Add details, a tummy, a tail, legs, and wings. Draw an owl. Make ears, eyes, feathers, and feet. Also draw a lion, a sea lion, and a funny whale. Draw a wavy line around the animals. That'll be the top of a tree. Draw the trunk. Color the animals with markers. Color the tree green using crayons. You can easily draw a cute picture of art all by yourself. It's kind of sad to be just an ordinary gray rock. Cover part of the stone with a piece of masking tape. Coat it with white acrylic paint. Paint the edge of the stone blue. Create a gradient effect, painting the stone stripes of different shades of blue. Draw green branches with a thin brush. Shade with yellow. Draw a brown trunk and a bright yellow field just below. Draw a road. Decorate it with bushes. Draw a black silhouette of a tree along the edge of the masking tape. Take off the tape. Add a trunk with white paint. Draw notches on the tree in blue. Isn't it great? A regular rock turned into an art masterpiece. And now you need some paper and tape. Attach pieces of tape to the paper to make letters. Spell out love. Pour some white paint into a disposable cup. Add a couple drops of blue and dark purple. Pour the paint onto the paper. Lift and tilt the sheet in different directions so that the paint spreads evenly. Because you didn't mix the paints, they form a cool pattern. The pattern turned out to be totally cosmic. When the paint dries a little, carefully remove the tape. Do it like this, piece by piece. Done! You can use this bright picture as a decorative background for photographs. Your apartment renovation is over, but the tiles are still there. You will need a metal strainer from the sink. Put the strainer on a tile and take some paint. Pour the colors into the strainer one by one. White, red, yellow. Wait for the colors to spread out and repeat the sequence of colors. Interesting patterns appear on the tile. Be sure to put something under the tile so you don't have to wash the table afterwards. When the whole tile is covered with paint, 
Carefully remove the strainer. Wait until the tile is completely dry. A little paint and some artistic talent and a beautiful flower will blossom on a tile. How do you like the idea of painting on black paper? Dip the edges of a flat brush into blue and white paint. Rotate the brush to draw a circle on paper with both colors. Two colors in one stroke? Art has never been this easy before! Draw a bunch of grapes on the paper. Add a green twig. Mark highlights from the sun with white paint. It turns out that drawing color transitions is easy peasy. Beautiful! And for this idea, you will need a sheet of paper and markers. Draw a curved line. Add one more line below it to make a shape like this. Draw a mirrored line underneath. It's starting to look like a big blue whale. You don't need to color it in. Just add shadows by drawing stripes. Draw more stripes in the upper part of the outline and leave more space between the stripes in the lower part. Use a green marker pen to draw a baby whale. Do the same thing, but on a different scale. You can also draw a bird like this. Connect the drawings. Decorate the frame of the picture with lines. The result will be absolutely amazing! This time take a piece of paper, a ruler, and a pen. Connect two lines at a 90 degree angle. Continue to draw lines on each side and connect them at right angles. Draw a curve starting from the outermost line. Do the same thing with several more segments. Draw curved lines inside the fold. Honestly, just draw it however you want. Once you get the idea, you can draw a picture like this pretty easily. The main thing is to not get carried away and spend half a day drawing. The creative process is totally addictive. When you finish the picture, you can decorate the wall of your room with it. See, it's not hard at all. So, what else would you like to draw? A simple sketch turns into a crawling baby on your paper. Turn it over and continue to draw. Add legs, a head, hands. Oh, now he's in school. All boys are so troublesome at this age. Once again, turn the sheet over and continue to create. Turn the legs into arms. Draw legs in a suit. Add the torso and the head. Our boy has grown up a little. And the final touch, draw a clear profile with a beard. Fill in the previous drawing. Add some details. And now you have got the next stage of life on the picture. He's an adult now. Wow, creativity accelerates the passage of time. Only a couple of minutes went by, but his whole life ended up on the page. For the next idea, you will need a sheet of paper, a capillary pen, and a pencil. Draw a cute hamster face. To make it easier, you can draw the outlines with a pencil first, and then just go over it with a black pen. Draw bushes around him. Give him some paws. Make neat cuts in the right places. Raise the cut parts a bit. Insert a pencil into the paws. A cute 3D picture will cheer you up and surprise your friends. And now take some paper and gouache. No brush? Don't worry, you won't need it today. Open a jar of gouache and collect some paint on your fingertip. Put a stamp on paper. Do the same thing with other colors. After the paint dries, take a black marker. On the orange print, draw fins and a tail. What a funny and cheerful fish! And the brown imprint turns into a spider. Today, it's in a great mood. And who is this yellow creature? It's a little fluffy chicken, of course! Let your creative impulses break free and draw small funny animals. A turtle, a pig, a frog, and a kitten. Are we forgetting anyone? What a cute group, right? Did you know that snacks aren't just empty calories? How do you like the idea of using crackers in your work? Put round cookies on a piece of paper. Add details with a marker. Within minutes, a normal cookie turns into a balloon. And this balloon needs clouds and birds to help it on its journey. Color the drawing with markers. Also, cookies can be transformed into Pac-Man or a bicycle wheel. Using cookies for creative purposes helps develop your imagination. And what would you draw? Let us know in the comments!
Did you like our artistic ideas? Which of these life hacks do you use in your art? Comment below with your thoughts. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click on the bell so you don't miss even more of Troom Troom Select's life hacks for art.